Hell yeah. We're back again once again for the first time. And we are going to be doing Pokemon Pearl, as was promised. Um, I'm going to be recording this episode one on the first day because I realized that recording the first episode is a lot of work, as you may notice. The layout is different. Um, so I have to figure out where the Pokemon are going to go, where the badges are going to go. I have to make all that shit work. I have to fit it all in. Oof, two screens up. Anyway. <laughs> Let's go on with the game. Look at the look at the little dragon above me. Look at him. It's little Dialga. Is it Dialga or is Dialga the time one? Dialga Palika. I can't remember. Hello there. It's so very nice to meet you. Welcome to the world of Pokemon. My name is Rowan. However, everyone just calls me the Pokemon Professor. Let's pick up all the professors. Before I go any further, is this your first adventure? If you need advice, I'm certainly capable of giving it. Hell no. Bear in mind, I'm going to tell them right now, I don't need no advice. This world is widely inhabited by creatures known as Pokemon. Here, I have a Pokeball. Touch the button on the middle of the Pokeball, if you'd please. Ooh. We humans live alongside Pokemon as friends. At times we play together, and at other times we work together. Some people use their Pokemon to battle and develop closer bonds with you. Do I do? I don't even know myself. I just kind of conduct research to it so that we may learn more. Now, why don't you tell me a little about yourself? Do you have a PP or do you have a Vagony? <laughs> There's a boy, why not? Alright, so you're a boy? Because <laughs> you a boy? <laughs> yeah. Tell me, what is your name? Oh, I can't remember. Isn't his name Ethan? <laughs> I don't remember. You know what? I, I can't. I was trying to think of the name this. I was a Brandon in the last one, but that's actually his official name. What is Gen 4's name? <laughs> Because isn't it Brendan and May, and then, what's this one, Dawn? It's Dawn and Ethan? Hold up a hot second. Lucas, it's Lucas. So who's Ethan? Uh... Mm hmm I could do this with the touch screen, but no. Nah. Move. Oh, so your name is Lucas? You're a boy? Ah, okay. So you're Lucas. My name that is. Now this boy here, yeah, I believe he's your friend. What might his name be? I don't know what his actual name is, but there's only one name for this boy. I don't know if it's too easy or an eight. When you press the select button, which is the A button, I think you try to press the direction, it just goes, no, it doesn't move. But we're calling him Tweak because he just reminds me of Tweak from South Park. Tweak is it, it's that's your friend's name. Yeah, sure, Grandpa. Oh, oh alright. Lucas, the time has come. The very own tale of grand adventures is about to unfold. Lord. On your journey, you'll meet countless Pokemon and people. I'm sure that along the way, you'll discover many things, perhaps. Even something about yourself. Now go on, leap into the world of Pokemon. Be on. <gasps> this is shrunk that. You have been minimized. Despite the exploration to best efforts, however, the rare oddly colored Pokemon eludes detection. The rumored red Gyarados failed to appear, even fleeing team into the Chaos Fallen team. That concludes our special report. Search for the red Gyarados. If you're wondering why this is opening the game, this is because this was their big, like, hint, hint. We're remaking Gold and Silver, the red Gyarados, and Black Boss and Silver came out after this. Brought to you by Jubilee TV on Nationwide Net. See you next week, same time, same channel. Okay. Now, 
Oh no. Okay, these buttons are okay. My A and B are switched. So I want the fast text. I want the frame to be Pearl. There we go. From that shit real quick. We're gonna save the game real quick. And no, this is the first game where it's saving a lot of data. And we have no speed up. We do, but we don't. See that? No speed up, bro. We gotta make full use of our running shoes and our bicycle cycle. Oh yeah. Which we have neither of. So I don't need no info. Uh Lucas. I'm tweaking one of you a while ago, why didn't you? I don't know when it was bad, but this is, it was an emergency. Guys called Tweak Bros. Everything's an emergency to this man, them. Scarbo. Oh, yes, Lucas. Don't go to the Swagwara Swap Pokemon attack you. It'd be okay if you had your own Pokemon, but you don't, so. Then fucking do it. Now uh, clip your balls. Uh, so slow. Huh. <laughs> Boop. What was that about? Hey, look at this. Uh, hey, I'm going to, like, you come to a credit about Okay, look, I'll find you one million Pokedons if you're late. Yeah. Oh, jeez, I forgot something. Yeah, you gotta follow him. His whole character is he's like, he's a, he's a tweaker. He runs at 100 miles an hour and he's, like, dumb as hell. Worst arrival ever. Yeah, you better see my back in jail, too. Yeah. Oh, hey, look at this. We're going to like I'm waiting on you on the road. It's a 10 million Pokemon I'll find you if you're late. Bitch, if I just left him, I'd have been the first and be like, where's my 10 million Pokedons? He ain't gonna pay me. He just wants it for more meth, bro. I want to run free. But I can only walk slowly. <clears throat> hey, you saw the news about the TV report, right? This refers to Gary Dawson. Uh, it's your support of various Pokemon in the lake. This got me to thinking I've been on a local because of Pokemon League 2. That's what we're gonna do, we're gonna go find a Pokemon like that. Okay. And now we have the little pop downs as well that come up nicely so we can actually see if we're entering a new area. Or not. Uh, Alright, let's go to the lake and find ourselves a red Gyarados. You don't want one to find a red Gyarados, that thing was mad. What's going on? But I didn't hear anything out of the order on the other side either. Mm, I may have been mistaken. Something appears to be different than it was before, but fine. It's enough that we have seen the lake. No one we're leaving. Professor, how are you enjoying being back in Zeno? So my head's like keep slipping down and that's pushing all my hair forward. I've been away for four years, it must be exciting again. Mm. There's one thing I can say, there are many records of Pokemon in Sino. The region should serve us very well in regards to what subjects. Where has he been for four years? Excuse me, let us pass, please. I beg your pardon, we've been away. Oh, what was that about those two? Oh, look, let's, let's go check this out. What's that? Don't go to the tall grass. No problem, we won't be in the long enough for Pokemon to come out. It's a briefcase. These people have got it here. What are we supposed to do with it? We can trade delivery, but who are they? I heard them say Professor. <laughs> oh no, not not pretty little birdies. Oh, okay. So he says, pretty little birdie. Uh, but Pokemon, what's going on? He just conveniently flops open. Look, there are Pokeballs. Let's start using these. Which one do you want, then? Big Toises. Now, I don't know what these are, so I literally just randomized this inside. So let's see. Garchomp? Oh, hell. Ignore the Turtwig picture, right? Ignore that Turtwig picture. Read the green text. Mark Pokemon Garchomp. Oh, that's just, that's a... Oof. Triple Bird Pokemon Dojo? Hell no. The Tapo Pokemon Poly Polyrath. Oh, 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 we are taking Garchomp any day of the week, bro. It's like Gen 1 and saying, join a Dragonite. Hell yeah. Oh, it came in my one of my ears, not the other one. No home at all. Um, oh man, it's got surround sound. It's really weird. Please say you have decent moveset. <laughs> Easy clap then. Dragon Rage. Nothing's got 40 HP at this point. I'm wondering if this is going to come through for you though. Because I'm hearing like... Like 
so slightly sound is coming out of this ear. Remember my video is backwards, so like it's coming out of this ear, which is my right ear. Guard chomp's noises are going in my left ear. Uh, your Pokemon totally rock, but mine was way tougher than yours. Uh, there are other people's Pokemon though. We should we should have to use them. They wouldn't mind, would they? Oh, there's the briefcase. The professor would have been furious if I lost it. Huh? Oh no, did you two use the Pokemon in here? Oh, you did. Oh gosh. What's the professor going to say? This is not good, so I'll take the briefcase for now. I honestly can't remember the voice already. No retention, bro. There's like nothing in there, bro. What was that about? No, no, what's going on, Lucas? Let's get out of here. My Pokemon hurt from their battles. If we can't take my other Pokemon, we might be in trouble. So how's your Pokemon stronger than mine? Mine was just like... Done. You go ahead. I have to return these Pokemon. They're not ours. I want to spend little time with my little guy. So we can actually look at this Pokemon. This is our song, our Pokemon. Bro. Level 5 Garchomp. Please be a good nature. Serious nature. 10th of April. There you go. See what they're record doing. Uh, Lady Rarity at level 5. Neutral? I swear in this game, it's like they, they're doing the colors. Sand Veil. Tackle Sand Attack. Dragon Rage Sandstorm. That is A1. Filet Mignon. We can't run. Can we speed up with the tab? No. I have to set it. Alright. Hey, it's those people. Why is your guy staring at us? <laughs> I heard from Dom that you use our Pokemon. Let me see them, please. Hmm. Garchomp and Turtwig. <laughs> Turtwig. But you took my Garchomp, you son of a bitch. <laughs> I see, that's how it is. Well, I'm going back to my lab. I need to poop. Uh, yes, Rufus, wait for me. Uh, I think you should visit our lab later. Okay, see you. What was that craziness about? I mean, if he's angry, he could have just yelled at us or whatever. He didn't want the Pokemon back. Uh, Lucas, we should go home too. The next day. Huh, oh, what's up, dear? Well, I can't believe this happened to you. I'm glad that both you and Twig are the hunt. The professor you mentioned is most likely Professor Robin of Sandjum Town. I've heard that he is well known for his studies in Pokemon. I hear that he's also quite intimidating. Lucas, I think you need to visit him in Sandjum Town. Oh, please. We need to properly explain why you have no choice but to use his Pokemon. Please. Don't worry, I'm sure he'll be understand, please. Oh, I know, Lucas, put these on. Finally, we're about to get some movement. Go to Sandjum, it's like an adventure itself, right? With those running shoes, you can get far away much place with a better before you are. Okay, let's read the instructions. Press the B button to dash about faster than before. What's the B button, bro? In IRL, what's the B button? But just someone just gave you some crap in real life and was like, press the B button to run. You're just like, what B button? But isn't that just nifty? <laughs> now, I think. Oh, you've become friends with Pokemon too. I got a guy from, bro. So yeah, he's not here. I was pretty sure he's not here. So we're gonna make some quick movements. I'm probably not gonna record the second episode of this right now, to be fair. <coughs> no Pokedex of Pokeballs? No Nuzlocke. That wouldn't be bad. A wild Evy? I can't reset my buttons, so my B is my A, my A is my B, it's the wrong way around. Because it's supposed to be like A is X, B is circle, because I'm using the PS5 controller, but like I've got them reversed, so X is to cancel and circle is to select things, which is what the Japanese layout actually to be fair. It's just I look at my switch and I'm like, oh, A is where the circle is, so I'd say it like that, and I was like, oh shit, it's backwards. Anyway, as like I said, Dragon Rage kills everything in this game. You see, we're a Garchomp, we're a, we're a, we're a Garchomp, we're a Sailor Legendary Garchomp, we have 27 HP. We got a move that does 40 guaranteed. We don't have to worry about nothing. Boo, 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 boo. Yeah. Also, I'm holding X to run, which is really weird instead of holding circle. Now, we could grind here, but because we got a guy jump, there's no point. Oh, uh, there you are. Please come with me. The professor is waiting. This is it, our Pokemon research lab. Let's go. Uh. 
Uh, what the? Oh, it's you, Lucas. The little guy, he's not as scary as much as he's totally out there. Uh, it doesn't matter, Lucas. I'm getting out of here. Wow. What was that? Your friend sure seems to be really impatient. Anyway, let's go inside. Would you like to come inside? Finally, you've come. Lucas was it. Let me see your Pokemon again. Oh, well, you've made your Pokemon a fossil. Have I? Alrighty then, I'll give that guard some to you as a gift. That is yours, would you like to give it a nickname? Oh, I remember a glitch with this guy. I heard about the very well, but it being your first time. From what I can see, there is a growing bond between you and that Pokemon. I pressed the wrong button. That's what I'd like to entrust you with this guy, Sean. I'm so glad that you're kind towards your Pokemon. If it weren't, I would just have to. Oh, I just can't say it. Slap you in the dick. <laughs> anyway, back to the main topic. There is something I want you to do for me. My name is Rowan, and I study Pokemon. First of all, I want to know how exactly what kind of Pokemon live in the Sinnoh region. To do so, it's necessary to play with the and Pokedex. That's why I wish to ask you. I would just do this Pokedex. Will you recall the little Sinnoh for me? Yes. Hmm. Good answer. If you said no, I'd just keep asking. So you say yes. The Pokedex is a very high-tech device. It will automatically record data on every kind of Pokemon you encounter. Lucas, I asked that every way you uh, meet every kind of Pokemon in this region. I got one too. When you walked up to Route 201 with your Pokemon, what did you feel? I've lived for 60 long years now, and even I never saw one of the Pokemon. Now you should know your account as Pokemon this world. It means there's just as many thrills waiting for you out there. Now go, Lucas, your grand adventure begins now. Oh. The Pokemon that I chose for the first time was Chimchar. If you had chosen Chimchar, Link, we'd be having the same Pokemon right now, which cannot happen because the game literally will always make her have the third one. Nothing matters, but anyway, I'm done. I also have the Professor on pages of the Pokedex, so in a sense, I'm just like you, but I've got a head start on you, that's all. I'd be happy to teach you things. I'm glad to meet you, Lucas. Yeah, remember how I said I don't need any advice? Yeah, this game is bullshit. Also, I pressed X because of a buzzer reverse, so I don't know what you're doing. I'm Okay, Lucas, I want to teach you a You've got a little bit of experience as you and the trainer and the professor's assistant. Follow me. Bum, 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 bum. I'm not going to do a voice for this because it's bullshit. This is a bit of a very piece of Pokemon side. It's basically a hill Pokemon to battle. You can find Pokemon since the most town. Uh, this is the Pokemon. It has a blue roof. This is where you buy shit. Congratulations. Thank you, game. I, I, yes, it doesn't bother you. Cool. Oh, that's right, Lucas. You don't need to let your family know that you're helping the professor run the Pokedex. You may go find a way, so you should let someone know. Oh, before you go, he'll be Pokemon Pokemon Center. You're not scared that way. Bye now. So bad. Anyway. We go down here to Route 219. If you've never played this game before, because there's a nightmare right here. Old Stone. Well, that helpful book. Okay. I will rename the guard jump off screen. I'll get like a save editor and I'll just edit his name. His name's Chompy, by the way. As is tradition. Uh... No, we don't need to heal because we've taken no damage. And plus, we can just do this. We don't have any Pokeballs right now, do we? No! We have no Pokeballs yet, cool. You know what, let's just go talk to our moms. We don't have to have any fire, so it's just like, if I've got Pokeballs, I can just go do my first two, three encounters already. Don't mean we're gonna catch him, but we can try. Welcome home, Lucas. Are you in your Pokemon health? Did you take a full rest here? Is that why would you heal before you come back when you're just gonna sleep in your mum's house and you're gonna get a full heal? What's up, Lucas? Ah, oh, Professor Oak, Professor Oak, Professor Rowan asked you to do something that big. Oh dear, you go for it. Your mum's got your back. Oh, my name, Lucas. I've got something you find very useful. A journal. <laughs> Link's put the journal key out in his pockets. It's a journal that keeps records of your daily events. Check and you'll be able to remember what you did last. Gee, a journey full of adventures. I envy you, kiddo. Plus, you're not alone. You have a Pokemon with you. I wish I could go instead. I'm just joking, dear. Yes, Lucas, it'll be right by myself, so you can enjoy your adventure. Let me go to Pussy Mask 3000 to go drill ourselves with all night. <laughs> when you're exposed to new things, you experience new sensations. It makes me really happy. Come back sometimes. But please knock first. <laughs> <coughs> oh, these are the kinds of Pokemon you call, dear. Excuse me, it's my tweak here. Oh, uh, no, he's not. Oh, he must have left already. What to do? The boy shouts about going on an adventure and bold. He's so hedgehog and reckless. It must be all the mess he has. At least we'll have him take this. That's why Lucas will give you the event to me. He won't just have. Hmm. 
Oh, really? Will you do that for me? Please take this tweak for me. Like, no. Ooh, the tweak's possible. Bye bye, Lucas. Enjoy your adventure. Let me think that my body probably can straight to Jubilife. I'm going to take that tweak. We have to. Listen. We can't go anywhere else. All roads lead to Jubilife. Like. <coughs> Excuse me. So we're still not in the Nuzlocke. Like, we still don't have Pokeballs. Uh, Robert D, V to be fair. Having this in one ear and the other is really annoying. Uh, what he has again? Oh, he's got Tackle. What does Tackle do? Is tackle, like, insane. They live a Tackle. That's good to know. He can live a Tackle. That's very good to know. If we do run into this bad boy, I'm going to DR him anyway, but still. I was going to say, no, why have I still got 10 Dragon Rages? And then, oh, I fell asleep in my mum's house. Which I guess means that power points return just from time, I guess. Or sleeping. Yeah, either way. Um, so if we go back, I think we can buy Pokeballs, which will start the Nuzlocke off. But... Oh. Hello there. I see you from a car chomp. Now, there is a... Maybe it doesn't have Dragon Rage, because there is a mode that I select in this game, which is basically to stop you getting absolutely having your cheek spread, which is called No Early Dragon Rage. Because <coughs> as you can see, Dragon Rage is absolutely busted. Because if that level 2 Garchomp lived and kicked Dragon Rage, I would die, and it would be... Well, not game over, technically, because I don't have Pokeballs yet, so I could just go and restart, but I'd lose a load of money and probably just be like, delete the recording and start again and re-randomize. Re but, to be fair, that might not have had a Dragon Rage. That's why it was allowed. Do -do 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 -do. Oh god, I've hated the system. <coughs> also, we get a Premier Ball. The three potions. Yep. And we'll take another. Uh, I think this is the first game where poison does not kill you out of battle. It'll take you down to one HP and then just say it faded away. So we're on the Pokeballs, so we are locked in the lock. But we can go get two encounters, because as you, uh, should we go heal? No, let's not heal. Let's get an encounter here, 201. Don't be a guard chomp. Iron Splout, okay. Okay, I'll take that. Please don't die to a tackle. I know it's a stupid strong guard charm. Oh god, it's level two. Don't be don't be boosting, bro. I just need you to be a very good boy. You can be as loud as you want. Here's a premier ball for you, G. Pat, cop this premier ball. It's special. It's just for you. Bitch. <laughs> He's raising his shits up though. Can't punch him again. The only thing I can do is this. Time of time. Because two things. Sandstorm ups the defense of ground types, rock types, and seal types. So we get extra defense, even though he's spamming health. Now the scary. He gets the plus six. That's three times damage. But Sandstorm will not just chip his health away, which it's doing right now. Alright, we've got that five or six turns. Thing is, we don't have a lot of money, so we don't have a lot of balls. So I don't really want to waste balls. Hell yeah. Oh, I guess I haven't explained, in case you're new to this, what we're doing in this game, why we have guard shots or something. We are playing the randomized Nuzlocke. I guess this is as good a time as any to explain it. Its house can be heard over six miles away. It emits all sorts of noises from the courts of its body. Give it since it's out, yeah. Boom box, baby. Oh my god, it's so delayed. You see, there's like a, like a second where it doesn't move before it starts moving again. That's what causes me to do wrong things. Anyway, we've got boom box. She's on the team. Uh, let's go and heal. What do you got on the counter here? Don't worry. Eevee would have been so good, not good. Because I could have got an Espeon or an Umbreon from it. 
but it would have been carried around. So yes, we're doing a random Um The luck has begun because we have our Pokedex and our Pokeballs. It means that we get one encounter per named area. So as you see, the name changes now. Sanjum Town, we are owed an encounter here. Obviously, we can't get one right now because uh, there is no way to get one. I don't think you can actually get one. Sanjum Town. <laughs> For every single route, cave, or named area, we can get one. The only exception is there are static Pokemon, which basically sit around on the ground. I would guarantee to be there. They are an exception. They don't, they're don't. they their own unique thing. But if any Pokemon you encounter faints, it's done. So if you run into a random encounter and it faints, or it runs away, and you run away from it, you don't get to keep it. You lost that encounter, it's too bad, so sad. Uh, if you, if you're a Pokemon fan, then you can't be used for the rest of the game. If you run that Pokemon, it's too bad. <laughs> if you run out of all six Pokemon in your team and white out, you lose the game. Simple as. Um, I'm trying to think off the top of my head of anything else. Um, we are allowed to skip over encounters, though, due to duplication and species. Uh, let's use the Pokemon from this game. Starly evolves into Staravia and rolls into Staraptor. So if we catch a Staravia, for example, and we run into another Staravia, we can say we've already got a Staravia. We can skip over it. Uh, and if you run into a Starly or Staraptor, we can theoretically as well say it's the same species, the same evolutionary line, and we have to catch it. Uh, Masala Wand, bro. Please don't die. At this point in the game, I take anything. I don't take anything. Just don't die to this tackle. Oh, this took a t it took a tackle. It has confusion. Oh, I want this boy. I want this boy. I want this boy. I want this boy. Please. I can't. I'm not going to risk it again because if we get a crit, he will die. We need all the encounters we can get. We really, really do. I should be taking a good track of this shit, but I literally can't be honest. I'll write it down probably after the episode. Because in the future we come back to these places, like we're going to come back to this place, and I'll know we've already been here because it's more than likely that we've caught the encounter here. Because in the game you just hoover up to a squad of six ASAP and try and hold on to that squad of six until you get something better. <coughs> uh, but what does randomization mean in the sense that we're doing a randomized stuff? Lock? I guess I should explain that too. Everything is random. So it starts with randomized Garchomp, Dodrio, and what's the last one? Polyrath. Completely random. Held items are random. In wild encounters are random, the trainers of Pokemon are random. That's all pretty cool. Items you find on the ground, hidden and visible, are random. TMs are random. Uh, uh, Pokemon themselves are not randomized, so they learn the same movesets, they have the same base powers, they evolve at the same levels. Uh, the only change is if you have an impossible evolution, so you require a trade to evolve or something like that, that has been taken out and they're evolved by level now, or just held, leveled up with a held item. Uh, <laughs> And all Pokemon above level 36 will be fully evolved. Anyway, here is Butterfree. It loves the honey and the flowers and can locate flower patches that have even the tiniest amount of pollen. Yes. If that's first right. Margarine. Fake bar. Butterfree. Butterfree. Margarine. Butter margarine. Anyway, two encounters, two or two, that's not bad. <coughs> so we want to get our last encounter before the episode's over, we're at 28 minutes. And make our way to Jubilife, which is where we're going to cut off. <coughs> which we should be able to do. So my throat is playing up again, I am still sick. That's a furry boy. <coughs> Technically a furry girl. Little tube sock. Uh, <coughs> The reason I run, we cannot speed up, unfortunately, so if the episodes go long, they just go long. We can run, though. So we're going to quickly get our free heals. <coughs> so we're going to fight, like, three trainers, and then go to Jubilife, I think. Or two trainers, I can't remember exactly how many. Um... Let's go. So we got to watch the catching tutorial because even though we said we played this game before, they want us to get tutorials and everything. Oh, that's right. Lucas, I haven't shown you how to catch a Pokemon. I'll demonstrate you how to catch Pokemon, so watch me, okay? God, I want to speed up so bad. But I'm not touching shit. Let's <laughs> bring my broken armor. <laughs> he did shit. Okay. I don't press no buttons during this at all. It just has the slowest tech speed in the world. 
it's just oh my arm. it's just slow as heck tech speed i'm not pressing no buttons this is just what it does enjoy enjoy the bullshit Shit, he put you to sleep. Madness. It's just a throw poker anyway, and it's just gonna go in. Look at look at this. Look. Press the bag. Press the bag. Press the pokeball. Don't miss it. Then press the pokeball in the pokeball bag. Oh, now you got press use. Good. My God, I've already. Bro, all you had to do was put in that flag that says I don't need any help. Don't give me help me. Or go, wait a minute, this guy's already caught two Pokemon. Why does he need a catching tutorial? <sighs> I'm not even going to read this in her voice, so it's just, it's just stupid. Season it neat, actually, it's better to lower your target's HP. It's more important that Pokemon's HP is as possible. Well. Help Pokemon very difficult to catch. Also, blah, 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 sleep helps. Blah, blah, blah. It's better Pokemon. Only because I know we're at 30 minutes and 58 seconds right now. Yep. And more Pokemon makes the game easier. Thank you very much. Thank you, Don. Thank you. So we don't have an encounter here, so our encounter here is. Here, Powdon. Ooh. Good, good, not bad. Bad, bad, not good, though. Because we can't use Sandstorm on this thing. Also, it's not shiny. The females are grey. And yes, here, Powdon is in Gen 4. It's the ace of the fake Agatha lady. Ah, but Bond's backwards. Oh, I mean, that would be good for catching Pokemon. We can put things to sleep, guaranteed. I don't forget to catch this boy, though. I think this is the last thing before Jubilife, anyway. Ow. Oh, quit it. Yep, we're asleep. But, let me do we have 13 Pokeballs? We should be good. I don't know if we're going to catch it, but we should be <laughs> Okay, it was one, and then slowly exploded. Right. Also, something we should know about this game that I haven't mentioned yet. The physical special split happened. So, you may notice that Hippow Wooden is going for Bite. Bites are dark type moves. Now, obviously, bite wasn't in generation one, but let's say water type moves, right? All water type moves are special in generations one, generations two, and generation three. In gen four, this game, they went, nah, depends on the move. So now, Crab Hammer, for example, is a physical move in this game. In red and blue, gold and silver, ruby and sapphire, it was all special moves. Now it's a physical move. Aqua Jet is physical. Bite is physical. So now you don't have to worry about going, oh, but my Breloom has a high attack and a low special attack. So it's grass having a trash. No, ain't true no more. Ain't true no more. They can actually fight back now. It's so good. This guy's breaking out without a single damn roll. Oh my god, he's doing like two damage every turn to me. He's breaking out like it's nothing. It's also, this, this guy's going to be a problem. Problem. It's gonna be a problem, it's gonna be a problem, man. Come on, wake up. I want speed up, I want speed up so bad. Speed up. Oh, don't be sad attacking me as well, bro. Okay, I just need to wake up for now. I just need to wake up for now, bro. Don't worry about the sun attack, I can swap you out. If he gets the tw 10, I need to heal him as well. Come on, bro. It's the end of the episode, stop making too so flipping long. Oh my god, he's going to do five turns of sleep. Hey, Jackie. I don't even really want him that bad. Oh, he is fully going to do the full five turns of sleep because that bastard. Now I've got to waste a turn healing, which means I always have to turn I can't wake up. Because if someone's throw a ball, that doesn't count towards the wake up. It's bullshit, it should do. It should just be like you can't wake up when you're throwing the ball, but it counts towards the turns. So you would wake up if you if it's been five turns and then you take a turn after three throw five balls and you take a turn, you should guarantee wake up that turn. Uh scratch my head, bro. Scratch my head, get hit myself in confusion. 
Wake up. Don't kill. Please don't kill. Thank you. Right, Paladin, you can do what you want now. It doesn't matter. Guy Chomp's taking it. Guy Chomp's a G. Your boy Chompy Chomps. Let's get him. Alright, he's in the red now, bro. He's level 3 and he's in the red. Start with some finances. I can only buy so many pocket balls, bro. Stop breaking out. You ain't no legend. Thank you. I would have tackled him again. But... The Paladin is added to the Pokedex. Its huge mouth is almost 7 feet across. There's enough power to completely crush a car. Yeah, I don't know for you. And that's a car it's normally as if it's a male. So we'll call it Mallow because it's teeth are like marshmallows. So I usually call the male ones marshmallow if he wants Mallow. <coughs> Excuse me. Oh my. So what could we got on this route? Tangler, thank god. Uh, actually, no, in this game it's not too bad. You can get a Tangro, so it would have been alright. Thinking about it long ways. So we gotta go fight this guy. You're a trainer? I happen to be a trainer. Or as met, so that one must. Okay. If you say so, brother. Elite trainer Tristan with his cans. What was that? Lag, bro? It's like. Ball just like squash for a whole like, solid two seconds and then open. Oh I don't even know speed up, so I can't believe speed up. What is going on with BS, bro? See, now we don't have to worry about these things. Watch this. Bye. Bye. <laughs> Goodbye. You can bring out a music. Oh, God. Two things as well I should add about this game. Bar filling up is terrible in this game. So just also that XP bar went up. HP dropping is bad as well. So I hope we don't run into anything that has a lot of HP because even if you Oko it, it slowly drops the bar. I spy minus my trainer. Let's battle these. She's only got two. She's got an ninja. Oh god. Please do not let me run into a shed ninja. I you and my get. I think. No, Sandstorm. I'm Sandstorm. I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm fine. Sandstorm kills said ninja. He's only got one HP. So we ain't doing any training because we ain't really got a boss at the end. Wow. We ain't really got a boss at the end of this. We just get into Jubilife. So we start the first proper episode in Jubilife. No, 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 Charmelon? Bring out the Charmelon, bro. Bring out the Charmelon, bro. Watch what happens to it. Man, it's gonna take me so long to figure out a layout for this thing, bro. I'm just looking at it like this thing's a mess. You just got like an, an L, so it runs along the bottom and up from my cab. There's a bit on the top. Oh, God. Hey. Oh boo, I can't win. Oh boo. Hey, laggy. Still already got an account here, so this is something good. That would have been fire. On the side, that actually would have been pretty good. I wouldn't mind how that. Really? I'll have to look what everyone's got. Uh, this is one more trainer here. Oh my, please. I want like three steps. I ain't even running. Flipping close that we are four times weak to ice, so I have not no way no how. No way no how. We running, bro. I don't care that we have a 40 HP damaging move that's probably gonna hit it in one shot. I'll be one of the most fastest Pokemon around. Not the, but one of the. I don't care, bro. What is this? Why are you bringing a Ladybug? Ladybug sucks. Man, is this Gen 2? DR, bro. Basically, DR on Garchomp is easy clap until like the second gym. <laughs> if we lose before the second gym, I will literally circumcise myself 
<laughs> I can't think of anything that's not too extreme or too lame. There's an item here. Still needing a camera. We're almost there, bro. Don't worry. You won't be seeing from the YouTube bar. We're almost there. We are almost there. I'm just saying to myself, but almost there, bro. Almost there, bro. Don't worry. We're almost there. We're so close. Actually, why am I, wait, no, no, no. Why am I fighting this? Get out of here. Get out of here. So I'm too busy trying to shit. Get out of here. We got an expert belt. Which doesn't slightly raise the super effective hits. Jubilife. Oh, hi, Lucas. Are you catching Pokemon? Wow, you've already got four Pokemon. That patient Pokemon should be full of time. No time. And Jubilife is a trainer school, which, well, you know. Lucas, you should visit it. You should get some notches on Pokemon. Oh, yes, tweak rings to trainer school earlier. Bye for now. First thing first, I'm the greatest. But screw tweak. We're gonna do three. We're gonna do two things here. Oh, we gotta to talk to him first. I, I, puppy. Time limit is too long, man. But still, let's do this. These two little kids won the battle. They want to test out what they've learned at the training school. So we're gonna oblige. We have. DR is one shot and everything they got, so bring them up, bring them up. Remember, there's no fairy types, so nothing can be immune to Dragon Rage. I can't move them in battle, kind of, no. Badger Flume. I don't have to worry about typing, I don't have to worry about attacks. Hit Dragon Rage and relax. Whoa. Hello, boy, Garchom. We'll probably do some training in between episodes as well. I want to get the encounters. I want to get two more encounters before the episode ends. I'm going to go to like 50 minutes. It's the first episode, we've got to have a bang, bro. So, it's like this kid, he thinks he's cool. Rich Girl Harrison. He's got a burn. A burn and ghost Pokemon, that's kind of weird. Also, screw Jifflin. All my homies hate Drift Loom. I was playing the pin, um, where is it? I've got it down here, hold on. In my underground collection of Pokemon games. Ain't really underground, they're just really far on the, where is it? <laughs> so chill. Brilliant Diamond. And I forgot that that thing comes out on a Friday. And I got there on a Saturday. <laughs> it wasn't there. And by the time I remember to go back, it was not a fry dick. <laughs> and I was like, I hate your flume. Wow, you're really good. We've been sending it every day, but we're no match at all. Please use a set of machine. TM says, I first TM, that's why I've done this. It's normally hidden power. Oh my god, I know what TM is. Shut Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Crab hammer. Oh, funny I talked about crab hammer. They just give me crab hammer. Anyway, this week. Hey, Lucas, did you, did you come to me too? I want to have memories. Everything is up on the blackboard. After I was returning to the job to with having the precious Pokemon hurt Mal, right? So, uh, uh, Lucas, what's going here? Uh, you got something for me? I think we can't do the event until this. This is Gora, it's a town map. Uh, what are they doing here? I like it a lot, but I need to hear. Lucas, take it. Oh, yeah. Hmm, well, because it's map, I guess Orbo City is where we should be going next, so, uh, this is Jim there, he's praying for us. Anyway, let's see on the road, we're coming to the channel in a little time, I'll see you later. So, <laughs> we will not be taking on Tweak today. We're going to talk to this gentleman here. Oh, 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 you call yourself a Pokemon trainer, you have no Pokemon. What is it, a Pokemon watch? Or Pokemon for short? Oh, it was a rare case indeed. You see, I invented the manufacture of the Pokéches. Not only that, but I'm now conducting a promotional campaign. Let's please find three times Jubilife City. If you can find them, I'll give you a Pokéche. There's one right there, so we're going to ignore him. We're going to go to the far, far one. And we're going to run straight past him. Ah? Well, you see, we're going to talk to this dude right here who says, Do you like to fish? And I say, Hell yeah. And he's like, Here, take my order. And I'm like, Cool, bro. Oh my god, I don't need the lecture, bro. Was it registered to? Why? Cool. 
So I find that coming here gives me a better chance of catching. No for the nibble. This is an encounter. Come on, bro. It's terrible. The encounter right here is terrible with no run. I've got an espion here before. I'm kind of crazy. Oh no, it's fucking quack attack, bro. It's pretty on called quackers. Now, he shouldn't be able to do shit. He might have a water type um, hidden power. Not hidden power, what's it called? Secret power. Okay, that done more than I thought. Hydro pump. Excuse you? Man just hit hydro pump. Man just casually hit hydro pump. Just this is Hydro Pump. Alright, I only done 6 though, I'm not too worried. I was like, oh shit. Like, Dragon resists, but ground's weak, so it's neutral. We are level 9, it's fine. We're 6 levels above him, and we're regard champion. We're fine. We're fine. I don't even worry about it. Don't even bust a sweat, bro. We've got 8 walls. We've got 2 encounters. We've got this one and one more, so hopefully he, you can get into this ball. Stay in there, please. Alright, you want to keep hitting me with hydro pumps, do you dirty bastard? Oh, no, it's not this way. Okay. Cool! Give me less balls to catch my next Pokemon with. How nice. He's not getting the ball, he's not standing the ball, he's not a good boy. Just ins. Why? You're a Ludicolo! Why are you instantly breaking out, bro? Can't speed up. Can't speed up. Uh, we've got literally two things to do when the episode's over. You know what? F you. F you, okay? And I'll burn the turn. Not waste the ball. Turns are free. Balls cost money. Oh, no, you don't. Cool. Don't start getting yourself HP back. You can suck my ass. There we go, because now he's in the red. Please take in the ball, brother. It's not even rolling, though. It's, it's like, I'm too good to take a pokey ball. Mm, suck my asshole. It's like, yeah, suck your asshole, bro. Did I just say the sandstorm ended? Oh, we had sand belt as well, wasn't it? We got invasion in the sand, so... We got plus evasion, plus we got a um, turn attack on him. Alright, Ludicolo. Stay in damn ball. Oh, look, we got Rum Roll now, he's on 5 HP. <laughs> Game's a fucking joke, bro. Bro, you're level 3, you're in the red. Why don't you roll three times? Even if you break out, why are you rolling like zero or ones? Like, what the hell, bro? I, uh, we ain't catching him. If you don't stand this time, you're dead anyway, so screw you. Nope. 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 Mega Man is the only way he stays alive. He's dead now. Sounds no damage. No, I don't, frankly, I don't want you. Even if you are living, I, I don't know if I want to throw a ball at you, to be fair. There you go, you're dead. Congratulations. Is it worth my time? No. Is it worth your time? No. Burn an encounter. That's all. Sweet. I wouldn't mind if it was a legendary, dude. It's a Ludicolo. Shit's acting like... What's that? What room is that? Route 218. I need to make a note of that. 218. Right. So let's do this quickly. Now, the secret to these boys is they're all going to ask you a question and you just say yes to all of them. Don't even bother reading the question. Just say yes. Just say yes. They ask you stupid questions. The Pokemon like to fart? Yes. Cool. So here's number two. Let's 
Yep, 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 yep. They like to use berries. Yep, 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 don't move like that, G. Yep, they get XP points by beating people. Cool. So you get well, three Pokéx. Um, this is Watch, Watch, Pokemon Watch, Pokéx. Makes sense, right? <coughs> Do we have any money? We can sell Crab Hammer. We got, we got nothing to sell. Oh my god, we got four, we can buy like two Pokeballs. We might need that though. The start of the game, that's what's annoying. The start of the game, everything is tight, unless you find like a car boss or something, or nugget, and you're like, oh cool. So anyway, let's go to this brother right here, because he's like, let me count your coupons. You got three, cool. Here's a watch. You can see that it's 15.45. Is it 15.45? Oh hell yeah, it is 15.45 right now, there you go. Yeah, you can see what time it is in real time, so you can see what time I'm playing this game. <laughs> If you're up north here, first things first, you can grab this. No, Mount Ice, okay, cool. You can get one more encounter. Let's try and get one more encounter and then, then we're done. Because honestly, I need to I need to take a break. Hmm. Toga piss. You got a toga piss, huh? I wouldn't mind the toga pee. I got a feeling Sackle's gonna kill it though. Alright. <coughs> Togepi can do what it wants, but we got more chances to catch in Togepi. Let's just try throwing the ball right now. You know what? Believe in yourself. <coughs> oh god. Shit's in my throat again. You know what? Why am I why am I putting up with shit in my throat, man? Stay hydrated. I think I got water down the side of me. It's like, my fruit's all dry and itchy. Its shell is said to be stuffed with happiness and it shares it with kind hearted people. Um. It's Egu. <laughs> Egu. So we call Egu. Now. <coughs> Let's go back to Pokemon Center. Now you can go up there and you can fight the trainers. You can't progress up there because that is not the way to go. There is Rock Smash. Rocks that are going to block you from going any further. You can get an encounter in there because you can go into the cave that needs Rock Smash. Um, but without limited resources, I don't know if we should go there now. Plus it's 52 minutes already. Do I want to make it an hour episode? Yeah, fuck it, let's do it. I keep saying we're done, but you know what? I keep forgetting we got a dragon that just dragon ranges everything to death. So let's, we can go up here. I think it's two fights. And we can't go any further. Oh, a big looking trainer. Where do you have to go? Bitch, I'm going to Cherry Grove City. Um, she's got a wing goal. Okay. What level is this? Like five? Seven. Okay. Doesn't matter. We're level nine, bro. Also, notice that we're level 9 and we only just have 40 HP. <laughs> Nine's got 40 HP. We're a stage legendary, fully evolved, stage 2 Pokemon. Like, we've only got 40. Hi, Mingo. Thanks for the HP. Oh, XP, sorry, not HP. Anyway. Oh, I should have said no. What do you mean you should have said no? You literally asked me to battle you. I was saying no. Man, they gave me some Pokemon. They're going to win for me. What with you, bro? Uh, elite trainer Tyler. I was an electrician on that one. Oh no. <clears throat> it's the icy boy. No, we're not scared because we outspeed and we go dragon range. Who cares? Oh my god, he's got hail as well. What an asshole. So no one went to the house on as his ice hail was how do you say this game? I don't know what it actually does, it power up ice moves. I it hurts you like sandstorm, but I don't know what it actually does. There we go, level 10. Jumpy's level 10. Bye, 
Ba-ba-ba-ba. Well, what else you got? Did I just say Wubba Fat? Oh, yes, yeah, something on him. No, I will stay. That trying to end my game already. He's like, yeah, yeah, I think you've had too long there with that little guy champ of yours. Hey. Anyway, he says something. Because I want the weather that actually hurts him and not me as well. You got Miracle? Go for it, bro. I don't think he's got Destiny, but I hope he doesn't have Destiny ones, I swear to God. Right, so what we're going to do. He has quite a lot of HP. Now, he shouldn't have more than 40, but what I'm going to do is burn a few turns. Accuracy for him means absolutely nothing, by the way. So I'm pretty sure counter and um, thing he cannot miss, but I just want something so I'm just chipping away a little bit. Two. And a three. That's four. That's three. I think he should die now. If he doesn't die with his guy chump, I'm not gonna be very happy. Right, cool. I wonder how much HP it does have. How much HP does it have? Well, before that is all HP, by the way. It's got nothing else. And if you're wondering how it works, counter does not have anything to do with your attack. Miracle has nothing to do with your special attack. It literally just says whatever damage he takes, he does back double. Like counter only works on physical moves, and Miracle only works on special moves. So if you use a physical move and you use a miracle, you don't do nothing. But if you use a physical move, you use a counter, you take double damage. Remember counter hit my turn? Muck lived that last game. So Muck was an OG. He was a menace of the hood. I was sipping his gin. I said, yeah, we're going to juggle each other. Who gives a shit? Let's make this an hour episode. Who gives a shit? Fuck it, it's the first episode. Enjoy yourself, bro. Enjoy this content. You've got two episodes worth of content. Nothing's happening. <laughs> I see what, what our boy has on him. Oh, you're so strong. Oh. Alright, let me check real quick. Lumberry was on Egu, and Boombox has Miami. He has a choice scar. Is that... Is that what he was spamming Hell? Like, he went for Howl with a choice scar for and it locked him into only ever using Howl. Anyway, we can grab this item. Which is... Super repel, not too bad. Could be useful, I guess. And we just run around here and we get our encounter, which is. Please let me catch this. This might be a problem. Nothing, nothing. You ain't doing nothing. Probably four times with this fire, come on. Don't die to the tackle. Shit, it's a critical hit. Okay, but well, we lost that encounter. We ain't gonna get another encounter for a little bit next episode. The start of the next episode, we will get an encounter, by the way. <coughs> We're just getting too strong. No? We got Super Repel? I wouldn't have minded that time. Same as I said in all the previous games, it's a stone Evo, so it's not gonna learn anything by level up. Oh my god, there's a Brava here as well. I got a Togepi. I'm gonna move back to Togepi. Togepi in this game has got his final Evo to get it, so it's beast. But it's not a fairy type yet, so it's it's not full beast. It's it's a bit beast. So the story when we can so we're gonna end here. If we go to come back, we're gonna run down this way, and we're gonna, once we go through these stairs, brother Tweak is waiting for us to slap our cheeks. But we're gonna go here and heal quickly because we are real MFNGs. Luckily, before I started recording, I, f I was lucky because I forgot to check if I played this game before on this PC, which I think I have not, because I got this PC relatively I a few months, but I've not played uh, Pocket Monsters on it, to be honest. Um, I've been playing normal games. So let's save the game here. Uh, because if you already have saved data on your emulator, same as if you had it on your DS, uh, you have to delete your save data to continue saving the game. So I wouldn't be able to do this save. I'd have to do the emulator save. But before we go, let's have a quick look at our boys. What we caught. Let's do a little wrap up. It's 59.40. So we caught a Garchomp. Sandvale Garchomp. 
we got an X Cloud with Rash Nature. So I guess it doesn't say because I'm not colored because Rash, I'm pretty sure, is neutral. Soundproof immunity, soundproof moves. Pound Raw, Astonish Hell. Conf solely Confusion Butterfree. With compound Eyes. Pokemon's accuracy is boosted. So generic, what does that mean? Mild Nature. Uh, we got Mallow, who's Rash. Sandstream, summons a Sandstorm. Tackle Sand Attack by Yawn. Oh, wait, we have Togepi. We got Togepi the Egu. Careful Nature. Hustle. Oh my god, why is it called Hustle Proof? Boost attack. Boost your power but lowers your accuracy. I just remember that being on. Um, what's it called? I. I. Dino. There we go. Let's I size right. I. I know. Dino. <laughs> Growl and Charm. No physical attack at all. He clapped on nine tails so hard. Anyway, so join us for the next episode where we'll be taking on Brother Tweak and making our way um, downtown eating us coming fast. Those kind of things. Um, oh, wait, is it in the Poketch or is it in here? No, it is in here. We're making our way to Orberg. As you can see, Orberg. We're going to we're going Route 3 to Orberg next episode. We'll take on our first gym, uh, the Rock Type Gym. Rock, Rock the Rock Stadium. I think that sounds about right in my head. Um, I haven't made notes of what I'm going to be doing in this game yet. I think in the last game, so <laughs> going to fight Rock and kick his kick his bum. Uh, and then we're going to make our way back here, and we're going to go up to uh, Forever Town, and then through some spooky forests to Eternia City, where the second gym is. But we're definitely going to be doing the Rock Stadium next time. Uh, we'll be returning to half hour episodes because I'm not just at the start of the game and going, Meh, there's not much to do. Let's just keep going. Uh, so if you enjoyed the first episode of our brand new Pokemon poll, randomize the stock, and we'll join us next time. Goodbye.